Hello everyone, this is Sue Broom, and I am here to do the weekly angel card reading for the week of April 1st through 7, 2019. And as you can see, I'm in a different location because I have now moved, and you'll be hearing the solar chimes go off quite a bit. So, um, hopefully you enjoy chimes. <laughs> I will be using the Miracle Messages deck by Joan of Angels. So as I'm shuffling, as I ask every single week, hold the intention in your hearts that the perfect cards come up for everyone, no matter when you are watching this. All right, so as I'm shuffling, none of the cards are coming flying out. So I'm fanning the deck and just seeing what comes up. And while you're holding the intention, if you would click the like button, the subscribe button, and the little bell, then you will get notified every single time I post a new video. All right, the three cards want to come out. And as I say also every week, these cards are for the entire week, not the beginning, middle, and end. So we'll see what the energies are. So I'm holding the cards to my heart as well. So here we go. All right, so let's see what this week has in store for us and how the angels can help support us. First card, as it drops, so that's kind of an important thing. When a card drops or is like really getting your attention, that's also part of the reading. So, so pay attention to that as well. <laughs> I love it. It says, Celestial Homecoming. Courage, you are being supported. Take one step at a time. That has been so absolutely yes for me. Taking one step at a time because I've had so much going on that I would be going in this direction, then this direction, then this direction, and I'd have to stop myself and say, Sue, finish this. One step at a time, one thing at a time, and then go to the next one. So celestial homecoming, and you can see there's a path. And I do feel like there's, like this is a really a celestial homecoming for me as well. So it'll be interesting to see what else comes up this week for me and for you, because remember, this is for everyone. This isn't just for me, this is for everyone. Next card we have is Interdimensional Gateway Celestial Sounds of Harmony and Balance, Vibrational Alignments and All is Possible. And so with the celestial sounds, you guys can hear, I have the chimes right behind me as well as I have chimes outside. So you're hearing both of them go off and on. And that's all part of it. There's one of the things I, I've noticed here is there's so many new sounds. I open up the patio door in the morning and there's just, it's totally different. So getting used to, getting comfortable, appreciating all of the sounds. And for this, the celestial sounds, it also, what, I, what I'm feeling is to pay, a, pay closer attention to whether you have a tickle in your ear, a buzzing in your ear, in your, I'm going to say your third ear, but you know what I mean, your um, energetic ear. But pay close attention because there's going to be some things, see, and there go the chimes saying, yes, Sue is, Sue is correct. <laughs> and the last card is rebirth. Oh my gosh. Life is calling you new opportunities for growth, miracles, and manifesting. And the thing that's really cool about this card is that this Friday, so April 5th, is a new moon. And how perfect for this week. So we have the celestial homecoming, the interdimensional gateway, and rebirth. What an exciting week. The angels are supporting us. Every uh, spiritual being on the other side is supporting us. One step at a time. And when we don't have courage ourselves, they will help with the courage. 
that's been coming up a lot as well for myself and for others that I know. So angel blessings to you. Have a magical week, everyone. Thank you everyone for watching. And if you would like to work with me, you can go to my website, suebroom.com. Have a great day. Angel blessings to you.